Good morning, Tony and Teo. A big debate is going on in the capital city. That shelter that is currently open in North Sacramento is set to open or, or close, I should say, at the end of March. In fact, the mayor says things are going so well, he wants to open up even more triage centers. But council member Angelique Ashby says she went to take a tour. She doesn't like what she is seeing, and she says Sacramento could do better. So there was a big showdown at last night's city council meeting, both Ashby and the mayor having a different opinion on what should happen with the homeless community and the current homeless crisis that is going on. That shelter opened up on Railroad Drive in December. It costs more than $400,000 a month to operate. Council member Angelique Ashby says the number of people being helped is being inflated. She says the mayor says it's helping more than 200 people a month, but staff on site have told her that only eight men and women are taking advantage of the services being offered. After taking a tour, she noticed the guests have to use porta potties, share outside, and have food brought in because they don't have a kitchen there. Ashby says she witnessed much more. If we're going to do something like this, we have to be better, right? Uh, I was not happy that there were 90 dogs in there. It's resulted in like three dog bites, one dog going down. I don't think anybody on the city council is going to turn out 200 plus people back onto the streets. And if you think that's what we're going to do, we're not doing it. And we'll find the resources and we'll find and, and we have the political will to do it. So work with us, please. Nobody's trying to foist anything on anybody. We're trying to solve a major community problem here. You can see emotions are running high here in Sacramento. Mayor Daryl Steinberg says crime statistics show a reduction in crime by up to 50 percent since the shelter opened. Ashby argues it's not the shelter that's reducing crime, but the fact that they've assigned a heavy police presence in North Sacramento. Despite the pushback, the mayor's proposing opening up an additional three triage centers throughout the city where people could stay for 90 days. He says they have $200 million to get help to the homeless community and to get them into permanent housing. But he says first, he wants them to go through the triage center and experience those mental health services that's that they so critically need. So they're having a big community meeting tomorrow night at 6.30 over at the Artisan Center that is on Del Paso Boulevard. They're hoping that a lot of people will turn out and voice their concerns and their opinions for the future. Reporting live here in Sacramento, I'm Leticia Ordaz, KCRA 3 News.